so you can play. Mini Wargaming's Who Would Win? <laughs> Mini Wargamer Dave here from MiniWargaming.com. Welcome, Wargamers, to another Who Would Win Mini Bat Rep. Today's matchup, Plague Marines versus Necron Warriors. Place your bets. Who do you think is going to win? This is going to be a fun matchup. Let's start with the Plague Marines and the stats for him. He's pretty much your standard Marine stats with fours across the board, except for toughness. He's toughness five, which is the mark of Nurgle. That's what it gives him. He has initiative three, though. That kind of affects that a little bit, but not against the Necron Warrior. That's not going to matter so much. He's Leadership 8. He is Fearless. We do need to mention that because that is a big deal. He's got Feel No Pain, which will definitely help him in this battle and also equal or uh, match your reanimation protocol somewhat. He's got Poison Weapons, which don't really matter so much because you're Toughness 4. And that is pretty much it. Oh, yeah. And let's also mention that he has two attack base because he has a Plague Knife and a Bolt Pistol. Let's not forget to mention the fact that I have blight grenades, which are defensive grenades, which means you don't get an attack bonus if you charge me. But the chances of you charging me are a little bit less because uh, I think I'm a little bit more mobile. Nope, not really. It just seems like it fluff-wise and faster, but not really that much. Your standard Necron Warrior, basically Marine stats with Initiative 2 and Leadership 10. And an armor save of 4+. plus. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's all you got. So, uh, war, um, Space Marine stats, initiative 2, leadership 10, 4 plus armor save. Their gun always wounds on a 6, always glances vehicles on a 6, and reanimation protocols giving them a 5 plus save they may take after failing their armor saves. And they may, you may take that save even when the shot or wound causes a wound that says you may not take saves of any kind. Not gonna last, dude. I, I kind of got lost in all that wording. But you know what? It's fine, and for a lot of us, they already know how it works. Okay? That's all it works. And today, Steve is my, I was gonna say component. Component? But I'm not a machine, Ooh, and you're not component. hardware, so that doesn't make any sense whatsoever. For points values, what we're gonna do is pit 10 Plague Marines armed with two Melta guns. Yes, this is market day. We're proxying a plasma gun and a heavy bolter, four Melta guns. And the aspiring Plague Champion, he is armed with a power sword and a combi bolter. All right, 20 Necron Warriors. Yep. <laughs> there are no upgrades or options for a unit. <laughs> <laughs> they got Gauss weapons. This guy has a special paint job. Uh, this guy has uh, a little more yellow in his gun, and this guy was upgraded to have a little more extra basing done. Okay, okay, okay. Let's roll to see who's going to go first. I get a three. What do you want to do? first? Obviously, you're going to move forward. You're full distance, six inches. Well, it's obvious to me. Is it obvious to you? I think. Yeah, I want to get everybody within 24 inches so I can start shooting at you right away. You know, this is going to sound like something obvious as well, but I've always thought that these guys look like the Terminators from Terminator. I think that was... And I think that's the inspiration. Well, the thing is, really is, the reanimation protocols was originally called We Will Be Back. <laughs> we Will Be Back. <laughs> so, I think... It's that's, kind of no, obvious. We'll Be Back. We'll Be Back. We'll Be Back, yeah. We'll be back. That's true. If that isn't blatant, I yeah. don't know what... That is something I have always thought for all of these years, but I don't think I've ever verbalized it before. Okay, now that I am verbalizing it, I'm just trying to distract counters. you from shooting me. I was hoping you are going to forget your shooting face. That's why I'm distracting you right now. Not going to work okay. So, Gauss weapons into... What are they called? What are they called? Gauss weapons. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Hitting on threes. You're... Uh -huh. Wounding on fives. Oh. Three plus save. Oh, two. Feel no pain. One dies. Plague Marines turn, gonna move forward six inches. Plague Marines are now going to shoot their bolt guns at you. Now the first row there, they're in rapid fire range, the rest of the guys are not. And you freeze to hit. That's a decent roll. Wounding on fours. Also a decent Ooh. roll. Four plus save. What? Reanimation protocols. One yeah. guy. Now there is a commie bolter on my aspiring play champion right there. In range to shoot once. And that's a twin link because there's a commie bolter. <laughs> and that's a hit. And I need a four to wound. And that's nothing. Necron's turn. He's going to move forward six inches, get a little bit closer. You're now six inches away. Necron warriors are in rapid fire range. That is scary. But go ahead. You're going to roll this twice. Rolling to wound. Five to wound. Not many. Three? Three. Second volley. Threes to hit. Fives to wound. A little bit better. That's nine wounds in total, three up save. That's two failed, five up feel no pain. Oh, two die. We're six inches away, I'm gonna move, so I'm an inch away from you. And get my guys into nice, close range. Five bolt pistols, threes to hit, three hits, fours to wound, that's two wounds. Four plus save, both saved. 
Now for the two Melthus. That's one hit and two to wound. That's a wound. So that does ignore my armor, but I do get reanimation protocols. But because it instant kills me because it's strength eight, I have to I take one away from my total. So I need a five normally. Now I need a six for a reanimation protocol. Fail, so one guy dies. I'm now declaring an assault with my plague greens. I'm gonna soul overwatch. Oh, you probably will. So these dice there, you're gonna roll it twice. Sixes, nothing, nothing so far. And the second volley. That's a little bit better. You got three at least. Five to wound. One, two wounds. Three plus save. Full save. Now for my charge range, 10 inches. That's enough to get everyone in combat. 18 attacks coming from my Plague Marines. I need fours to hit. Eight hits, wounding on fours. Two. Four up save. One failed. Reanimation protocol. Five plus. Made it. Now for my Plague Champion, who also hits on fours. That's two hits. Wounding on fours, negating your save. That's two reanimation protocols, five plus, one dies. Out of all of those attacks, would you look at that, Steve? Initiative step, pile in, move. Can you take me out? 17 attacks coming back my way, hitting on fours. Wounding on fives. Two. Three up save. One fail, feel no pain, five plus. That's a save. Necrons fail combat by one, leadership nine. That's a fail. <laughs> and let's do an initiative roll off. I get a six, and I think they are overrun. Yeah, overrun. Wow. Toughness five is a, is a big deal. Absolutamente. For all intents and purposes, Plague Greens have won this mini bat rep, but what Steve and I are going to do. We got to see who would win this slug out here. Yeah, we're going to just slug it out. So we're going to pretend that that leadership test was passed, and we're going to continue with the fight. So let's go on to the next fight subphase. Plague Marines hitting you on four, 12 attacks. Wounding on fours. That's three wounds. Four up save. Three failed. Five up deal no, or reanimation protocol, so you lose two. Plague Champion now. Fours to hit. That's three hits. Fours to wound. Negating your save. One reanimation protocol. Failed. One more dies. 15 attacks coming back from the Necrons. Hitting on fours. Wounding on fives. That's four wounds. Three up save. Made them all. Lost combat by three, leadership seven now. That is a pass, let's continue. Next round of combat, Plague Marines hitting the Warriors, hitting on fours, and wounding on fours. That's two, four up, save. One failed, five up, reanimation protocol. One more dies. Plague Champion now, hitting on fours. That's three hits, and wounding on fours. That's two, reanimation protocols, and pull save. 13 attacks coming back from the Necrons, hitting on fours. Wounding on fives. Three up save. Made them all. And I gotta get the reaction here because it's all good. Lost by one, leadership nine. And that is a pass. Next round of combat. Hitting you on fours with 12 attacks. Wounding on fours. Two. Four up save. Made them both. Plague champion now. Hitting on fours. That's one. Wounding on fours. That's one. Five up. Reanimation protocol. Save. 13 attacks coming back from the warriors. Hitting on fours. Wounding on fives. Nothing. Next round of combat. Hitting on fours. Wounding on fours. That's three wounds. Four up save. One fail. Five up reanimation. Save. No, 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 never mind. That's a fail. Plague champion. Hitting on fours. That's two hits. And wounding on fours. That's one wound. Five up reanimation. One more dies. Eleven attacks back. Hitting on fours. Wounding on fives. One wound. Three up save. That's cocked. That's yeah, not. Yeah. Five up, feel no pain. Made it. <laughs> All right, next round of combat. We're gonna go until someone wins. Look at that, that's more of a, that, look at that. Wounding on fours. Three, four up save. Two fail, five up reanimation, one dies. Play champion, hitting on fours. That's two, three hits. And wounding on fours. That's two wounds, two reanima reanimations, that's two more fails. Eight attacks coming back from the Necrons, hitting on fours, four hits. Hitting on fives, for one wound, three up save, that's a fail, feel no pain, that's a fail, I lose one. Lost by two, leadership eight, that's passed, next round of combat. We weren't expecting you guys to last so long. I can say the same thing for you. Now ten attacks coming back from the Plague Marines, hitting on fours, only two hits, wounding on fours, one wound, four up, that's a save. Plague Champion now hitting on fours. One. 
Wooding on fours, nothing. Eight attacks hitting me back on fours. Wooding on fives, four, nothing. Okay, right to the bitter end, we gotta do this. Hitting on fours, wounding on fours. That's three wounds. Necron save, four plus, two failed, five up reanimation, one dies. And for the aspiring plague champion, hitting on fours, wounding on fours, nothing. Seven attacks from the Necrons, hitting on fours, one hit, and wounding on fives, one wound, three up save. That's a save. Lost by one, leadership nine, passed. So at this point in the game, we're at like turn nine or ten or yeah, something like that. <laughs> what we're going to do is declare this as a draw. But we know that the Plague Marines won because he failed your morale. You, I failed my first morale and you overran ran me, but I mean... But had you not failed it, had I not, I mean, we would have gone good. on a long time, right? Point for point, the same points, good counter. Basically, we bog each other down. Yeah. Tie game, second game. Second game. Vault members, click on the link below to see our next matchup. It's going to be Blood Angels in a Fast Rhino versus Warriors in an Open Top Ghost Arc. If you're not a Vault member, we invite you to click on the link below and sign up for a free 7-day trial so that you can see this Who Would Win Mini Bat Rep. If it wasn't for the Vault members, we wouldn't be able to do this. It is them that enables us to make these videos and we really do appreciate your support. So please click on the link below to see this Bat Rep. And if you're a Vault member, click on the link below to see this bonus post-game show for this Who Would Win matchup that we have just had. We're going to discuss the tactics and the different possible builds and scenarios with Plague Marines and Warriors. We'll see you in the next video.